Okay, so right now we're going to talk about um, loading a text editor into your Chrome browser so we can do some coding in for HTML development. Um, first thing you want to do is you want to go to the Chrome Web Store. So you can just type in um, Chrome Web Store and it will take you to the uh, Chrome Web Store for Google. Once we're here, you've got all kinds of extensions that you can add. Uh, we're looking for a particular one, so we're going to type in text. And when you get text, you want to go down to the um, to the app. And what we're looking for is this app right here. So this text editor for, so if I can click on this, then I can see some reviews of it, whatever else I need to do. This has a thousand reviews, got four stars. That's what we're looking for. You can then read the reviews, do support. But we're going to add this to our Chrome. So you want to click just add to Chrome. And you want to add the app. Perfect. So it goes into your Chrome app. So now you have it as a Chrome app. So that's great. We want to add it to the app. We're going to click it. And now we get a simple text editor. And here we can start coding some HTML. So I'm just going to paste in some HTML here. This is a basic doc type HTML head, um, the header. And then you've got your body. And then you've got your closed HTML. So the title of this page is called Welcome. And it's called Welcome to the Test. So I'm going to go ahead and open this up. I'm going to click Save, or Save As. Actually, you want to save it as. And you want to put it somewhere um, where then you can say index. In this case, I've already got one. Uh, let's try HTML. And we'll save that. So I've given it a name, and I've given it a .html. So it's basically a text file with a .html. So that's awesome. And now I can go right back here to Chrome. And I can go to File, Open, Open File, which is Command-O. And I can go back to my desktop. And I can browse to um, Index2 and open that up. And there is my Welcome to the Text. So here's my file. And there's my thing there. So if I, if I say Welcome to Page Editing, and now I hit Save go back here and hit refresh, it now changes. So now I have a text editor where I can actually do some stuff here and see it in real time. Thanks.